It's coming on 24, 23 and a half centimetres. And push it too far. There, yeah, gone to 32. I'm in the red. I'm gone way too far. Now the green is coming at just 33. Taking a good sample off this point. Sending the fluid was the first bit that was clear. And then the semen came, made it, made it cream. See him extremely raising his rod. That was a great sign. So about 12 months now he's producing a good sample. Not in any of this company. Yeah. I have all my microscope size and compasses heated up to 37, 37.1 degrees just to keep it warm. So when I put this semen onto the microscope slide, it doesn't suffer from cold shock. Okay. One drop there for cold spotility, it's one drop here for progressive. So my cover slide on one of the drops and up onto the microscope. So I'm looking at gross motility there first. I imagine it's like a bunch of starlings up in the sky, swirling around. That's what I'm looking for, and I score this from one to five. You see this bull there now, even though it's a score of three, which, which passes him. I collected an awful volume of similar fluid, mm. which dilutes my sample. Mm. And that's why he's only scored three. I'll just move on then at a higher magnification to the progressive button. The vet and the farmer selling the bulk is to take a stain from morphology. So we have a dilute sample of the semen here. Let's take a little, little sample of dilute semen. Place it on the slide here. Now we want to stain this that. It's a tiny drop. With another slide. It's on the slide down now. We're going to smear it across the, the slide to make a stain for morphology. We'll dry, we'll dry that now. Let's balance this up. Put it on a level, a level surface. We'll dry that, label it, and I look back in, in two hours and that's dry and I look at the morphology of the semen. That's to check is there any sperm defects like bent tails, proximal droplets, distal droplets, check the shape and size of the sperm. There's, there's all different different defects that we go through. I, I count a hundred sperm, count a hundred, hundred and out of that hundred there'll be say 80% normal and there'll be 20% of defects. That's the general run of the rule but it's important to check that it's, it's, it's an insurance policy for the farmer selling the bull and for the vet that has seen and tested 